Hey, what's up, everyone? Welcome back. This is absolutely insane. This woman returned a couch for a full refund to Costco after using it for two and a half years. And they gave us our refund, full refund to his card. So, yeah, it worked. That's crazy. Jackie from Seattle remembered when she bought the couch. An employee oh, looked up look that transaction and the money was returned. On its website, Costco guarantees customer satisfaction on everything it sells, with the exception of appliances, diamonds, electronics and gold bars. Damn. That's awesome. So really, in theory, you could just buy a new couch every two years from Costco. And say, I... say what? So she bought this couch, used it for two and a half years, and returned it to Costco because they didn't like the color and they refunded her 100% of her money? That is sick. All right, this is her video on TikTok that has gone viral. Let's take a look at it. Come with me to return my couch to Costco after two and a half years with no receipt. So today we're doing something that I've never done before, and that is we are returning a... That she's never done before. I don't think anybody's done this before. Two and a half year old couch to Costco. Damn. So we bought the couch from Costco um, two and a half years ago, right before we had Santiago. And I don't know why I was so nervous. And they don't um, have the receipt. I think because like it's been that long, but like we bought it from Costco, so... Bro, this is crazy. This is nuts. First off, look at the stains on this couch. You used it for two and a half years, and this you got. You said you got it just before you got your kids. So then your kids been on it. You're you just been using it, abusing it, and then you return it. I do want to premise: it is very intimidating going in there with a big giant purchase and you're returning it <laughs> no shit. so it's like very intimidating there's a lot of people staring at you but who cares return it they have an awesome return policy definitely <sighs> look online i don't think you can do it on electronics cigarettes alcohol but buy your furniture from costco girl you can return it when you don't like it anymore damn that's I crazy didn't film after because we were in a rush and stuff but when i got up there I already knew the date that I had bought it because I had taken a photo of when we were bringing it up to our apartment at the time because Damn. I was pregnant and I couldn't lift it. So luckily I knew the date. Um, I told her around the date that I bought it. She looked it up in the computer, told me exactly which one it was. She found the like online, whatever she looked at. And then she goes, okay, cool. And that was it. She just Costco's going to be changing the return was, policy. Was wrong with it or I just didn't want it or like like it anymore and i said i just didn't like it anymore which is we just don't like the color anymore and what? they gave us our refund full refund to his card so what this is absolutely crazy so you're telling me you can buy a couch from costco or furniture or certain select items use them and abuse them and return them whenever you feel like it there should be like some lenience there but two and a half years later and you decide just because i don't like the couch and you found out their policy you return it and get a full refund and that's just crazy your farts are in that thing god knows what you've done on that couch what kind of bodily fluids are in it and costco's like yeah sure no problem here's your money back you have no receipt no problem here's your money back that is nuts they're definitely going to be changing this policy soon i bet you if they don't i'll be in shock so it states here, Costco has a 100% satisfaction guarantee return policy with few restrictions. I guarantee that's going to be changed. Simply bring the product to any Costco warehouse and our member services team will be happy to assist you if it helps if you have the receipt or original product packaging, but it may not be necessary to process your return, the return policy states. So you don't even need a receipt and it doesn't even need to be in the original packaging and you can return it. But it helps if you do. What's crazy is their policy does not say that items must be returned in a certain time frame or in a certain condition for most merchandise. So it could be completely destroyed. Uh, if you all want me to actually test this theory, let me know in the comments below. Please like this video. Let's make it go viral. If, I get a, if it gets a lot of views and comments and likes, I will test this out. I will go to Costco, buy something, completely destroy it, and return it and just say, I don't know, I just don't like the color and see if they'll return it. It says there are exceptions for electronics, jewelry, cigarettes, alcohol, car tires, and batteries, airline tickets, gold, and special order items. All right, so anything other than that stuff. I didn't know how many people knew you could buy gold bars from Costco. So it says the couch return video drew some backlash on TikTok with some Costco customers berating the woman for taking advantage of the policy. 
Go figure, comments are turned off. <laughs> no doubt you use a couch for two and a half years and you return it for full value. That's insane. One customer said that is effing wrong. One woman reacted, you used something and you loved it with your kids and your animals and your whole family and used it for two and a half years. And just because there's a little loophole in the store's policy, you think that it is morally right to take that couch back and get a full full refund for it for a used item that there was nothing wrong with. That's That's true. So it states that her reaction video drew over 15,000 comments and nearly 2 million views. Top commenters seem to agree this was an abuse of the liberal store return policy, which is true, and other people are now going to abuse it. I don't think Costco was really thinking people would be doing this, but there are some people out there, the exception, that will do it. And this is the thing, another comment said, you are not wrong, people abuse Costco's great return policy. And it also stated that last year, another Costco return video went viral on TikTok after customers returned a two-year-old mattress, a used mattress, so they could put the money towards a new mattress. What if it's stained? Like, what kind of stuff? Like, like oh, I don't even want to be <laughs> It's so gross. A two-year-old used mattress. I bet you this new woman saw that video and went, I can do that and I can go viral. And it actually worked. Hmm. Maybe I can buy stuff from Costco now and return it. But the problem is, is are they going to change this policy? All these people are now going to try to abuse this system. So I came across this and was like, what? And I had to share it with everyone. This is absolutely crazy that Costco allows this. I'm wondering if they're going to keep it allowing it or not. Imagine using a mattress for two years and returning it after it's all stained and gross and just covered in all sorts of bodily fluids. Same with this woman and her couch. Like, talk about just, like, ugh. But hey, if it's their policy, it's on them. You know, it might not be morally right or correct or whatnot, but if people want to abuse it, they will abuse it. And I know times are tough, so hey, if you can buy a couch, buy a mattress, use it for like two, three years. I wonder if there's, it says there's no limit, so you can use it for like 10 years and return it, but you can always get a new one, which is crazy. Honestly, that's pretty sick, and shout out to Costco for that. That's pretty rad. But, like I said, if you all want me to see how far we can take this, let me know in the comments below your suggestions on what I could go to Costco buy, use, or intentionally destroy, or whatever you come up with, and I will try to take that item and return it back to Costco and just say, I didn't like the color. <laughs> I'm looking forward to see what you all state in the comments. Definitely gets my brain going. But yeah, like I said, please like this video. Let's make it go viral. Share with people. Click, comment down below with your thoughts and suggestions about what I could and could not do, and as well as this whole thing. And we'll try to make it. We'll make it. We'll try to make it come true. Like if you want me to buy a couch, use and abuse the heck out of it, do all sorts of different crazy stuff to it, and then return it and just leave it in the condition. Don't even like clean it or nothing. Let me know. Like my first thoughts is like taking a couch, going out to the park and like skating the heck out of it and then like setting it on fire or something and just being like, yeah, I don't like the color of it because <laughs> it doesn't really state that there's any exception. I could just be like, you know, I'm just not 100% satisfied with this burnt old piece of shit carver couch. Oh Lord. And if you can, please do me a huge favor and click that subscribe button for more. Thanks for watching everyone. Stay safe. God bless you all. Take care and peace out.